So it has been a season of releasing albums yes. from Hat the Band <laughs> to Moji Shot Baba uh -huh. to Arrow Boy. Yes. Am I forgetting anyone? Uh, Arrow Boy. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if mm. so far. Hat the Band, Yes. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> and guess what? This time round, it was the one and only Nina Ogot. Yes, the album was dubbed Dala. I'm a kama my producer when you're talking about it. Dala. I'm a kama to some Dala. It means home. <laughs> it it means, means home. It means home. And this guy, uh, Nina, is phenomenal. Mm. But what you get, Mingi, we angalia love to Kirudi. We'll tell you about Nina Ogot. Cool yet sassy, calm yet intense, collected yet vibra energetic. All personalities that define this mellow Afrofusion singer, composer, and guitarist Nina Ogot, tones that she embodies so well in her music. <laughs> making music um, it takes a while to create music and sometimes it's done in silence so this is why maybe you get the impression that you haven't seen me in a while but voila Right when tongues were about to waggle about her silence, a great invitation came calling to a concert held at the Alliance Francaise. Dala was a piece of work, literally, work that involved intensive collaboration between German and Kenyan bands. The Germans in this band come from different areas in Germany. And so it was actually the guitar player who asked me, because we had to work together before, and uh, well, I run a horn section in Germany with the other guys, and so he asked me to get in to, with a complete horn section. Dala means home. So this is me trying to, as much as this was done in Germany, I wanted to take my home to people around the world. And it starts with the Germans. Now we launched it first in the soil where it was created, which is home, Dala. My feelings are excitement. I feel like it's been a long, long time coming. And my fans who've known me for all these years have been patiently waiting for it. So I'm too happy to release it. Yeah. <laughs> Earlier this year, Nina Ogot was honored by an initiative called Treasures of Kenya. Well, last year I was invited for an event in Germany, in Cologne, uh, by an organization called the Treasures of Kenya. And what this organization does is it looks for the treasures of Kenya, the things that are beautiful about Kenya, anything and they found music and they wanted to showcase it to Germans and so they invited me and gave me a band to work with and the band was German. Uh, first time for them to hear Kenyan music and it was wonderful and a few months later we decided to make an album and this is Dala, the album. Treasures of Kenya was looking to engage a musician that can uniquely and ably merge traditional music with modern and international forms influences, thus painting a true image of a contemporary Kenya without losing the traditional elements. Nina's magic in her style. She is charming and she's straight and well organized. And the people came together. We have a keyboard player who is in salsa music from South America and we have horns, classic German horns, and we have so many people from different... Listening to Dala, the album, was like a healing transcendence. The music had this power to captivate you into deep thoughts for one moment and just before you got lost in thoughts, she found you and threw you right to the dance floor. Wholesomely, Dala is inspired by African music giants such as Kenya's Mzengala, Fadili Williams, Daudi Kabaka, as well as Joseph Kabesele of Congo, Fela Kuti of Nigeria, and Manu Dibango of Cameroon. Such a befitting album title, Dala.
I hope we will have big festival gigs the next year. We are working on that. Not just that everybody moved in any way, but the whole audience moved left and right, and it was a beautiful view. This, the fact that it has happened is the most memorable thing. It's taken forever to happen. <laughs> and the fact that it, it, tonight it happened is just it's amazing. Yeah. Uh, Nina Ogot is definitely one of my favorite female artists from Kenya. Mm -hmm. Her album Mbali Fanya na Bwanake in Ajulikata Kama Yote Yote, Bwanake Winyo, is phenomenal. Like, you have not gotten yourself that album, please. Nenda pale SoundCloud, mm -hmm. search for Nina Ogot and Winyo. Mm -hmm. Alafu cheki album in Yote Yote. You will love the music. Kwanza wala ametoka semza kule, mm -hmm. western, Sumudala. kule nyuman, sumudala. <laughs> Utapenda mziki yao sana sana sana. Alright, so we are coming to the end of the program. Remember to talk to us. You can simply uh, do that via our SMS line that is 20154 beginning with channel 1 and then you can find me on my personal handles on mm. social media that is Vivian Degwa across all platforms. Absolutely. I mean pale A double B I H M G U M A that's Abinguma. I love Grapevine on KBC that's Facebook and Twitter until next week same place same time same people ningo to do regular. You know what they say if you didn't see it on Grapevine most probably never happened. Love and light. What you gotta do?